Hi everyone, welcome back to the channel. Today, we're going to dive into a fascinating topic, aging, what it is, what senescent cells are, and why they matter. Plus, I'll share some exciting updates on what we are working on at Ropa Spiceutics to tackle this issue. So let's get started. Aging is a complex process that affects our bodies at the cellular level. One key aspect involves cells reaching the end of their natural life cycle. When a cell divides around 50 times, the end of its chromosomes called telomeres get shorter. Eventually, these telomeres become so short that the cell can no longer divide. These cells are known as senescent cells. They may not seem harmful, but they play a major role in aging. Certain factors accelerate cell division, such as injury or UV light exposure. More cell division means more cells becoming senescent. Now here's where it gets interesting. When a cell becomes senescent, it releases inflammatory factors that can make surrounding cells also turn senescent. This creates a chain reaction. We know this from studies where injecting senescent cells into middle-aged mice cause accelerated aging. Conversely, removing these cells has shown promising therapeutic effects in older animals. Drugs called senolytics have been developed to selectively kill senescent cells. Administering these synolytics reverses signs of aging, such as loss of grip strain, cognitive decline, heart failure, and more. Why does this work? Because senescent cells produce inflammatory molecules, which in turn accelerate aging. This process is known as the senescence associated secretory phenotype, or SASP. One key SASP molecule is interleukin 6 which activates immune cells to produce oxygen radicals, leading to DNA damage and chronic inflammation. This chronic inflammation is a hallmark of aging, contributing to age-related diseases like type 2 diabetes, atherosclerosis, and cognitive decline. Removing senescent cells reduces these inflammatory factors and allows the body to regenerate. Did you know the body has amazing tools for self-healing, including stem cells? For instance, people with higher numbers of stem cells tend to recover better from strokes. Unfortunately, as we age, senescent cells increase and release factors that inactivate stem cells, reducing the body's regenerative potential. At Robles Biocetics, we believe that optimizing regeneration starts with removing these inflammatory cells. That's why we're developing topically administered senolytic agents that help clear these cells from the skin. Our preliminary data shows that applying our proprietary senolytic cocktail on mice with photodamaged skin not only increases collagen production, but also boosts the number of stem cells in the skin. This is a huge step forward. We're currently expanding our research and aiming for clinical implementation in early 2025. We're excited about the potential this approach holds for improving skin health and rejuvenation. Thanks for watching everyone. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more insights on regenerative dermatology and science-backed skincare. Stay tuned and remember, your skin is worth it.